Okay, we're about to dive into the full walk around of the 2022 Civic Si. Be the first to know each and every time we have a new walk around by hitting that subscribe button right down there. Okay, let's get to the Civic Si. Okay, so there's been a lot of talk and opinions and we've heard it all online. Well, here it is. And we think the new Si will make some of you eat your words. And no, you haven't seen this before. Check it out, 1.5 liter, 200 horsepower, turbocharged engine, front mounted intercooler, limited slip diff with rev matching and a short shifter from the Type R. Do we have your attention yet? Yeah, we thought so. And we haven't really even gotten into this thing yet. Four decades of the SI brings us here. Put it in gear and let's go. Numbers, numbers, numbers. You're here for the data, right? And we get it because it's all about the power figures. But this is far from the truth here. Honda has added a revamped 1.5 liter turbocharged and intercooled VTEC engine that creates 200 horsepower at 6,000 RPMs with 192 pounds of torque. Let me guess, not enough change, right? Well, those power figures play the game differently with the new SI, and here's why. Power is created earlier in the torque curve, giving you greater straight line acceleration from a stop or exiting a corner because of the early onset of its torque. The horsepower is also made earlier in the power band and now holds its peak power longer to redline. To get full use of that power, a helical LSD or limited slip differential drives both front wheels at the same time transferring the most amount of power that it can to the pavement. The result is more usable power throughout the entire rev range rather than peaking power momentarily. This is a noticeable difference in the drive character of its performance that must be experienced. Use of a new single mass flywheel that builds the RPMs even faster than before has greatly aided in this area of performance to achieve these results. Selectable drive modes now let you choose between normal, sport and individual mode which allows you to custom set your driving mode to your style. Have you mastered heel toe shifting yet while driving manual or do you even try? No worries. The SI has rev matching to create perfect downshifts for you by helping to ensure your gear change has the right revs coming into the downshift or turn it off and practice techniques for your next track day. Shifting is way more on the money with the Civic Type R short shifter being handed down by its sibling. I think that guy talks way too much, but if you like what he's saying, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. Okay, he's about to get into the engine part. Enjoy. This time around, the styling goes back to its roots and offers a clean slate on style. It's rounder, wider, and we're not afraid to say it, it's meaner looking. And that's all before the tuners decide the direction they see above all the new tech and the new styling the SI has. With the last generation SI and Civic models, we kind of did a lot of the work for you with all its angles and body kit type looks. Whereas the new SI has a choose your own adventure approach enthusiasts will enjoy putting their own stamp on like the late 90s. Honda pays great attention to what's relevant in the enthusiast performance and racing communities. And much of that can be found here in the SI today and forever. We're building on a proven track record of success with the SI yet again. So we're not new here, folks. Air cooling for performance is fully evident with all of the venting found on the front end. Additional flow can now be directed into its intake and front mounted intercooler while also allowing more air into the engine bay to help cool the turbo and vital engine components. Smart, effective, and it looks solid. Bold LED headlights up front and LED taillights out back blaze through the night to help illuminate the way. Ride presence is aggressive and on point with shock factor matte black 18 inch wheels standard. That's not enough though, the blackout is in full effect for the SI this time. Black finish is found on the window trim, front grille and rear lower diffuser. Plus piano black pops off the duckbill rear spoiler and side mirror caps. Add the classic red SI badges front and back so there isn't any mistaking just what this Civic is. The exterior finishes off with dual exhaust out back since that's what most people will be seeing, it's rear end. Okay, you're comfortably sitting in the SI's cockpit and you can clearly see the mission that Honda has laid out in front of you with its six-speed shifter waiting. Get it in gear with the performance, technology, and connectivity to find the drive that suits you and more. Honda has virtually thrown everything at the SI's interior. Everything except, well, the kitchen sink because, well, who's really throwing sinks around? Like, who actually does that? The SI sports seats are well bolstered and make you faster simply by association, we think. Okay, not really but they do feature a dual color design with vibrant red center inserts on black with the SI logo on each front seat. The red stitching on its seats is also found on its doors and steering wheel, which ties together the sporty red accents across the dash. The all new aluminum shifter unit feels more precise and offers great looks to complement its aluminum pedal setup and the SI mats. 
know exactly when to shift with the sequential shift indicator above the 10.2 inch digital display. Getting connected is easier than ever with wireless connectivity to Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on the standard 9 inch color touchscreen. Once you're connected to the SI's 12 speaker Bose premium sound system, the hardest job is picking your favorite driving songs. Need to charge up your smartphone? No problem. Simply place your compatible smartphone on the wireless charging pad and you're done. Add the full suite of Honda Sensing technology and you're well on your way to work, the racetrack, or your driveway. To find out more, visit Honda.ca.